guys, welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys this morning. I just woke up. <laughs> but I wanted to um, make a video for you all, as always, when I get up. As you can see, I have a haircut, so don't make fun of me. <laughs> It'll grow back in how it used to be. That's always the worst thing, is when you get haircuts. And it's not where you want it to be for like a week or so. But whatever, that's just me. Um, today, guys, what we're going to do is... Um, the first episode of our quest to masters. As you can see, I am at 2348 trophies right now. Um, and I did make a new base. Uh, the, the last one worked pretty well, but I just wanted to, uh, I don't know, I've, I've been in a base building mood lately. I built like three bases. Um, I need a, I need to boost these. I didn't realize they must have ended overnight. Um, but so what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show y'all one defense replay um, where I lost with this base, um, and then I may I only lost one one star. So you know one star is not bad. I'm I'm fine with with losing a one star. I really am because um, you know it's 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 generally going to happen a lot. The thing that you want to try and avoid is is the two stars because obviously that's where you lose the the most number of trophies and that is not what you want why is this no I want to boost that one um, so I, I got one started the other day after making the base and I watched the replay and it was really really close uh, to um, I, I just got distracted there we go <laughs> um, okay so I'm gonna go ahead and just go in here into our defense log and we're gonna replay this one right up here okay and now this is hog rider so here's a new base I'll I'll do a video on this um, in a little bit but I just wanted to go ahead and show y'all the replay on it um, so somebody spawned in right there by the Tesla so um, you'll see some changes that I made there I took one wall from these corners right here and I put them in each of the Tesla compartments um, now they're just drawing out my troops as you can see up to the corner and he does have max level troops as well which um, says even more about the defense winning um, because I don't know he just has higher level troops that are going to do more damage so here come the hog riders um, as you can see they're working their way in um, he uses when does he use his heal spell uh, right there now these hogs right here in the bottom left those guys a bunch of them get taken out by that bomb which is perfect placement um, and then now they're running around in the middle and I don't have any spring traps in the middle I just have bombs and with healing spells he's not gonna be able to um, he's not gonna take enough damage from the bombs to actually do anything so he's still working his way around the outside he does have a level 17 barbarian king um, and he used witches so right now he's just working his way around the outside and um, he wasn't able to get to the town hall his hogs were able to get in there but nothing else was because they didn't clear the way good enough um, now I haven't watched this top one right here but we are gonna go ahead and replay that and see what happens because I did make some changes I added some spring traps to the middle um, and all that kind of stuff so let's go ahead and see where he's going to attack from looks like he's gonna be attacking from over here at the left side once he takes out this archer queen yep so there he goes he has max level hogs as well so they are going to come in here um, and where are my spring traps so there's gonna be some spring traps right there alright so that's perfect placement between that mortar and that air defense there's a bomb right there um, which doesn't do enough damage obviously there's another bomb with a spring trap in the middle next to it and then once they get out of here to uh, this Tesla, I believe that I have a spring trap out there as well, right on the other side of it, but I actually don't think they're going to get to it that time since they didn't attack from the top. Um, so when it comes to hog riders, guys, spring traps are the most important. These guys are going to get kicked when they run over to that air defense, and there they go. So there go three more hog riders. That's awesome. That's exactly what you want to happen to the hog riders, um, is have them as they're transferring from defense to defense get taken out by um, by the spring traps because otherwise they're just gonna run rampant and uh, everybody does heal spells and if, if I had um, multi-target 
Inferno Towers or something on my base, and I'd be able to crush them. But 41% uh, with that, guys, and that was 32 max level Hog Riders. So uh, that's awesome. That's that's exactly what I needed. So you can see these spring traps right here were very very effective, as were these. Um, this spring trap did really well, also, um, and so did this one. And all of those are for when uh, that way you can protect every side of your base pretty much. Um, the top part of my base doesn't have any traps in it, but once they go from these two defenses and work their way in, some of them are going to go from this mortar into the expo, and some are going to go to the wizard tower. Um, but as they work their way around the center, you'll see that um, you'll see that what what am I saying? That they're just going to stay in there and work their way around and and get flipped by all of these spring traps. So that worked really well. I'm definitely happy with how uh, this base design worked. Um, this is, I'm, I'm calling this like the number two base or something because as you can see this little center compartment all the way around here um, makes a number two. Why don't we go ahead and um, can I do, let's do, I don't want to do a race mode. Whatever. Um, so we are going to go on the attack right now. I definitely need to get myself some elixir because not some gems. <laughs> I need to get myself some elixir so that I can raid better. Right now I have hogs. Um, and yeah, we're trophy pushing. We're trying to get up there, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and go on the attack. And oh, goodness. I'll be back with you guys in just a couple. Wow. In just a couple of seconds, right? All right, guys. So I'm going to go after this base right here. Um, it looks like it has pretty good loot, 197,000 elixirs, good, 633 dark elixirs, pretty good, and it also has 23 trophies available for me, um, and also all of his, uh, all of his heroes are down, so, um, I'm gonna go ahead and just start seeing what I can pick off on the outside of the base, um, and then we're going to go ahead and deploy our deploy our hogs right up here and let's get into uh, into this center one right here and we are going to rage spell our hogs right now um, there we go drop my king and my queen over here as well um, and let's keep on raging them come on guys we're gonna rage them to right there Yep, so some of them get there in the middle, and then we are going to drop our Pekkas along the outside. This is a very, very random army comp that I did. Um, I was out of Elixir, so uh, yeah, that's why I have this army composition. <laughs> so hopefully we will be able to get up there into the center of the base. I really want my Pekkas to... Um, stop it, Pekkas. Go in. Go in. There you go. Right, I'm going to drop a rage spell right there as well, right on the edge. See, we can't get them in there. Um, and I'm going to drop my clan castle as well, which I believe is just full of archers yet. So hopefully we can get up in here um, and head towards that town hall, even though those Teslas are doing some work on our P.E.K.K.A.s. Um, we can, our archer queen actually might be able to uh, get in there to the town hall if the other troops are not able to. That P.E.K.K.A.s being stupid. Uh, yeah, the, the Archer Queen's definitely going to be able to get in there once she gets rid of that uh, wall right there. I, don't, I guess she just stopped to reload or something. Run up in there. Come on. Alright, so that mortar is going to do work on her, but um, hopefully she can shoot quick enough in the next minute and a half to take it out, and I definitely think that she will be able to. Um, I do want some more of that elixir from up in here. So... Is it in? Yeah, it's definitely going to be in the storage. Come on. There we go. Come on, Tesla. I mean, Pekka, you're being too slow. <laughs> and the Archer Queen is about to take out the Town Hall right there. Come on. There we go. Alright, good. And there goes the Pekka. I'm going to go ahead and end the battle right there. Uh, well, can I get any, any more... I don't want my Archer Queen to lose any more health. Yeah, we're just going to go ahead and end the battle. So that worked really well, guys. 15 uh, trophies for me, which is awesome. 150,000 Elixir and 60, 
633,000 Dark Elixir, uh, which is definitely going to help with any kind of hog type troops that I run. Let's go ahead and um, boost this and let's do, what do I want to do? Let's do four rage spells and then why don't we go ahead and do an old fashioned uh, We're gonna, we're gonna do some P.E.K.K.A. rating, okay? We're gonna grab two P.E.K.K.A.s and let's get some, let's get let's do that same kind of army comp that we just had. We're gonna do 20 Hog Riders. And I'm getting rid of my healing spells because I've been trying to attack uh, Town Hall 10s that have the multi-target and healing doesn't do anything. So it's just a waste to have those spells in there. We already have eight Wall Breakers. Let's get two more. And let's bring in, um, Let's bring in some wizards as well. Let's do f let's do ten wizards. We do ten wizards, <coughs> and then let's just get five archers, and we'll see how this works. Um, but that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. I hope that y'all enjoyed. Uh, this is the base that is working very very well uh, right now. As y'all saw, max level hog riders could not take it out. Um, once I did those few tweaks with the spring traps in the middle so um, I'll do a base build on this shortly you guys can try and figure out what it is or you can come visit my base but I'll do a base build shortly um, but this was the first episode guys of uh, Road to Masters League I guess we'll call it um, everybody calls it that no let's let's call it uh, nah, Road to Masters whatever <laughs> Um, so we got ourselves some trophies. Uh, I also woke up, so when I woke up this morning, I had, uh, I got 23 trophies from that attack that was failed, and then we just got ourselves 15 from that, so that's 38, guys. Uh, we're doing good. We are definitely, I definitely think that we're going to be able to get there. I'm slowly maxing out my walls with the gold that I get, um, and saving some for searching, but... Yeah, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, I hope that y'all are excited for this Road to Masters. Um, let me know what you want me to do. If you want like one a week and you want me to show a couple attacks or if you want um, multiple ones a week with an attack and uh, maybe one or two reviews where I get some trophies. Let me know what you guys want in the comments and uh, yeah, keep calm and clash on, right? I'll see you guys later.